Running as a justice Democrat, did you find them or did they find you? It was a little bit of both. Okay. Um, so initially with justice Democrats, they were kind of one in the same with Brian in Congress in the beginning. Mm -hmm. So they, there was a, um, I think the first justice Democrat was Ro Khanna and he was a, a Californian uh, congressman. So I knew about justice Democrats already just from watching TYT and I wanted to be a justice Democrat from the minute I ran. So like running immediately, I already jumped into the race as a progressive, somebody that was not going to take any corporate PAC money, somebody that was not going to align myself with the establishment. Um, so I wanted to be a justice Democrat, brand new Congress candidate, just straight up from the beginning. Um, but the process initially was only through nomination. And I myself was one of those people that thought, I can't nominate myself. What am I going to say about myself that's going to make me stand out uh, above anything else? Uh, but luckily, uh, my community actually, you know, believed in me and they had nominated me before I even had thought of, of finding somebody to nominate me. So they reached out to me, oh, wow. uh, let me know that, that there was a, that I received multiple nominations from people in my oh, community wow. to to be a justice democrat and the vetting process i'm not sure how or why but my opponents somehow got in in there as well to to be vetted and of course you know once you just get to speak with them and and you see that it's like pulling teeth to talk about medicare for all then i was absolutely the only progressive <laughs> in the race so i was the yeah. the person who was endorsed um, nice. really really early on in my race it was like the first major endorsement that i had nice how did that organization help you they helped me tremendously honestly because uh one of the things like that i just mentioned you know regular people we have no idea how to even run we don't have the networks we don't have the resources we don't even know how to file what to file where to file or even how to look up the positions that you can actually run for so they helped us out with number one getting our name out there so that was a big one they they were able to get us on like TYT. They were able to do like, I, I think the first uh, digital events that I, that I had were through Justice Democrats. They were able to give us some tools like phone banking tools. And then they also gave us a nationwide base. So mm -hmm. we didn't just have people in my district that were helping us out by finding Justice Democrats through their website. But we also had people nationwide who supported just Democrats across the board and get on the phones for them uh, and, and, and phone back for us. So it was probably my, my first experience and my best experience. And it's something that I want to continue providing for, for candidates is that kind of support. You know, when I had a question and I had nowhere to turn to, I could always turn to them and ask them, like, do you guys know what's going on? Like, what can I do? So we became a very close knit family. I believe for like the first, you know, 10, 15 of us, we were like family. We awesome. all helped each other out. We created like this little group of to support each other. And I think that that's something that you even see in the movie Knock Down the House where, yeah. you know, Alex and, and Paula Jean are, are calling each other on the phone. That's kind of the relationship that we had and we still maintain. So with the Justice Democrat, um, I'm curious uh, what you think about their strategy um, that they shifted to. In 2018, you know, they kind of cast a wide net looking for candidates. And then in 2020, this time around, they kind of focused on certain districts. And I'm curious what you think about that strategy. I think that's the best strategy. I think that's something probably that they, I, I would assume is where they received the most complaints. Mm -hmm. uh, from their just Democrat candidates because we were all brand new. We mm -hmm. were all fresh, like we had no idea how to even run campaigns and we really did depend on Justice Democrats uh, for support. Mm -hmm. And uh, as that slate continued to grow, mm -hmm. the resources just became smaller and smaller. And I think that them taking the strategy by supporting just a handful of candidates, but supporting them all the way, is the right strategy. And that's something that we did um, with future generations ourselves. Like we don't want to stretch ourselves thin. We secure funding for a certain state before we go into a state so that we can actually provide the resources and the support to the candidates that we're promising. Gotcha.